Hey guys, it's your Ford Mustang here, and today we are going to be going over episode 68 of Ultimate Driving Leaks. So anyways, let's get into the video. So, I would like to start out the episode with the Victory Road portion of the Ultimate Driving Universe. For those of you that didn't sign up, you don't have to worry about it anymore because tomorrow access will now be available to everyone in the ultimate drying universe and for any roblox player in general the release will happen today at 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time which is 10 a.m. Pacific Standard Time and it also applies to whatever time zone you are in. So, with that said, there's also a brand new car coming to Ultimate Driving with that update, which is the Mercedes AMG GT3, or in fictional terms, the Superbia GTS LM. And I gotta say, it's one of the most incredible looking Mercedes that I've ever seen on Ultimate Driving. It's the third GT3 car to ever come out in the Ultimate Driving existence. After the McLaren 650S GT3 and the Porsche GT3 RS. Making this giant piece of history and Crowell Tuts as the first GT3 car from the German nationality to ever reach ultimate driving. This is going to be a blast testing that out later today. And I'll be more info on it in the stream. And there'll also be a separate video of reviewing the cars that I haven't done already. Moving on from the carbon fiber Mercedes AMG GT3, we are now heading towards the leaderboard replacement. So, if you notice that recently Roblox made an update to Ultimate Driving's leaderboard, and apparently it sucks because it sometimes abbreviates the money for players. Most of the time, with players over 10 million, and even is common for over 1 million. However, that's all going to change with 20 Pirates' new leaderboard that will be added in the Ultimate Driving. All the money, miles, bounty, and there are even some new additional things that will be added on the leaderboard if you toggle with the tab, such as trophies, racing gems, and waste fuel. By default, it'll just show the money, miles, and bounty. But if you press tab, you can also move around the leaderboard to a different part of the screen, even the middle of it if you wanted to. I'll link the YouTube video in the description from 22 Pilots due to copyright reasons and I'll also record the, the Twitter video of the part where you can move around the leaderboard and where 22 Pilots moves his cursor over to the new added stuff that will be going on to the leaderboard. The video that will be listed in the description will also feature new camera effects which is experimental in the PVV beta testing victory road update if you signed up although it's most likely going to be available for everyone with the camera effects later today so the camera effect basically shows the effect as you're driving the faster you go, the more further away it zooms out to give it an appearance as if you're going faster. 
and giving that real life experience touch. You'll especially see a notice when you use boost. And if you slow down, the car will go closer towards the screen as it zooms back in. We know that 20 Pies has always wanted to make Ultimate Drawing a realistic experience. So that's a plus. Although, there may be one downside with the new camera effect. That is farming with your car. Basically, grinding on I-76. I'm not sure how it's going to be maneuvering the car when you drive on I-76 in a new update. Especially when players are grinding for money, miles, and bounty. Specifically, credits and ultimate driving. But on the bright side, at least you'll see an even more realistic experience as you're going faster, which seems to be pretty cool in my opinion. We'll only have to find out about what effect it has on grinding when it's available to everyone. In addition to the camera effect, Twenty Pites is also adding the camera bouncing effect made by Crazy Man 32. And give it even more pizzazz to real life functions. Not to mention, there will also be two green stripes next to a player's name on the new leaderboard for a citizen team. Colors will vary depending on what team you're on. So it's most likely going to be the same color as the team, like Transit being purple, for example. There are improvements with the school bus that 22 Pies just recently announced. In today's update, we'll be able to drive the newly improved school bus and test it out to see what it has to offer. There are also improvements to cones. On different ultimate driving teams, the bases are orange. However, in the next update, the bases will now be black. And overall and quality improvements of the cones will make a huge difference with them from the past. And of course we know what everything has passed since the last episode of Ultimate Driving Leaks with that big mega update of 17 cars on Christmas. Another update containing Three new cars, which are the Conan Zangiesco, also known as the 2020 Ragnarok Odin, the Ferruccio Tuano, which in real life terms, that's the Lamborghini Sion, and the 1997 Aqua NSX or Cuba NXT. There are additional updates to leak as well, in which I'm going to put them on a separate episode, such as the police update phase 3. There is a lot, and I know for a fact that is definitely not going to be coming out today. So, I'll put that down in a separate episode, as well as future leaks that 22 Pirates announces. But anyways, that's going to be it for the video right there. I hope you guys enjoyed the video very much. You may like this video. Comment in the box below for your thoughts 
about everything we covered in the 68th episode of Ultimate Driving Leaks. Especially the part that everyone can be able to test out the victory road portion of Ultimate Driving later today. With the new Super Via GMS LM. Mercedes AMG GT3. Join my Discord server located in the description and you may subscribe. Bye!